So I just recorded you guys a video, and my microphone wasn't working. So I'm slightly pissed off, but it's okay, we're going to record it all over again. What's going on guys? It's me, the bugs are bad. Got some epic news for you today. So you know, I've been looking for the one. The one that I can be excited to see every single day. One would be broken inside, but still be lovable. One that would let me get rough if I wanted to, and not hold it against me. You know, one with problems, but not problems that were so bad that it's just too much to deal with. One that I saw a future with. Well, I found that one. I think she's beautiful inside and out. She's not high maintenance. She's very reliable. And I can always go to her and know, when I want to do something, she's down. Her name is Camilla, and I think you guys are really going to like her. So it's time to introduce you to her. Or her to you. Depends on how you look at it. I can really see me and her being together for a long time, so I really hope you're going to like her. Alright guys, so this is Camilla. $500 car. Where there is a will... There is a way. And I've proved that today. I've already driven about 100 miles on this thing. And it hasn't blown up. It did have some issues. It needed to be fixed. Slightly. Um, the throttle cable was stuck. Which means that the, uh, the accelerator would stay accelerating. Even if I wasn't touching the gas pedal. So yeah, that was a little scary. Um, as you can see here. The door handle is broken off on the outside. Um, the tires are dry rotted, which means they need to be replaced at some point soon. Sorry, I put my finger in front of the camera. But like all in all, for a $500 car, it has 206,000 miles on it. Um, it's a 1994 Toyota Camry V6. It's a pretty fresh whip, dude. It gets the job done. At that that's a goddamn fact. It gets the fucking job done. So, this definitely means that we're going to be able to do a lot more Iowa streams. We're going to be able to go places that are a lot more fun and exciting, etc. Um, but yeah, I mean, I'm, I don't think I'm going to really be speeding too much in this thing. It's, it's a fucking grocery getter, in my opinion. But... Hopefully you guys learn to love Kamala as much as I love her. She's a good car. I'm sure you want to see the interior. Like, oh, you just showed us the outside, Bugs. Yeah, all right, here's the interior, okay? The interior is clean, too. The interior is actually way more clean than the outside would have you believe. Very fresh, happening car. It comes with cup holders. It has a moonroof or sunroof, whatever. It goes back, everything. The AC does not work. But again, $500 car that runs reliably. Um, but yeah, again, all in all, it's, it's been an awesome car. For those two days that I've had it. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll start it up for you. It does have a check engine light on. Why? I don't know, but I don't feel any detrimental issues. The speakers work. It has an aftermarket head unit. Aftermarket. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a pretty decent car. So yeah, that's Camelot. $500 car, not bad. Very reliable, 206,000 miles. I cannot complain. The car is like 24 years old. No, actually it is 24 years old. I've been very busy for the last two days trying to make this thing run completely, properly, reliably, and effectively. It still needs new tires, they're dry rotted. Uh, for those who don't know what that means, it means that they've decayed. They're not exactly worn out, but they could blow out at any given time, so I don't want to travel too far with them. Once I feel like I can start traveling, then I will take you guys for a 
some fucking IRL streams out in East Bumblefuck. Because, again, the transmission, the engine, feel great. You know what I mean? I don't have an issue with the car. The CV joints don't click, nothing. It's a, it's a good car. But in the meantime, I've just been applying for jobs. Anything, really, that my body can physically handle with my disabilities. I don't want to push myself too hard, but I'm not going to limit myself. I'm just applying to anything, and I'll see see what the job entails, etc. But I'm taking anything, and then from there, I'm going to look for something that better paves a path for my future. So this month is going to be very, very tight financially. I literally have, like, just enough money for rent, and I still have to show up to my job to get the paycheck that will make me good for rent. And I don't, <laughs> I don't think they're going to be too thrilled about seeing me. And they really don't have a reason to be fucking mad at me in like 10 fucking minutes. See episode 3 if you don't get what I'm saying. But yeah, all in all, making a lot of progress, dudes. Fucking slaying the day. Only a month ago, I was, I was a disaster. I was absolutely a complete wreck. Emotionally, physically. I, I weighed like 115. My ribs were popping out of my skin. And like you see, I'm, my face is filling up a bit. But, yeah, it's been, it's been nutty. But we're fucking destroying it. There's only one person who controls your future. You know who that person is? Right there. That's right. That's right, so there's no excuses. Literally no excuses. There's always something. There's literally always something. And if you say there's not, I don't know what to tell you, man. There's always, always something. So go fucking slay the day. Get yourself your own $500 dumper car. Please make sure that you have a certified mechanic or somebody to take a look at this car. Don't just go fucking buy a $500 car. You'd be crazy. And start building your future. Do it. And if you already got a car, even better. What the fuck is stopping you? So yeah, that's today's video blog. We're gonna, we're gonna wrap it up here. If you don't already, follow my SoundCloud. My Twitch, my Facebook, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Snapchat, and of course, sub to me on YouTube if you enjoy my blogs. Um, I am planning on talking about other things. I just I got a lot of shit going on in my life, so a lot of people in my Twitch community have been wanting to know what's going on in my life because they've watched me for the last two years, and my life, my life was. We kind of went up like this, and then we kind of plateaued, and then just like that, dude, and we're like, yeah. So they're really excited to see the kind of progress that I'm making in such a short period of time, so hopefully we won't be talking about me as much, unless that's what you guys like, and I've been telling you a million times in all these fucking vlogs, they tell me what you want me to talk about, but you don't tell me. Don't tell me. Okay, some of you do. But most of you don't. I mean, I do appreciate you commenting. I hope you comment on this one. I hope you like it. I hope you share it. You know, I hope you do something with it. But at the end of the day, I I can't thank you guys enough for watching this. You guys are the shit. We still have a giveaway going on for a $10 Amazon gift card. The link's going to be down there in the description. But hopefully you guys are all having a great week. Friday is here, pretty much. This video is supposed to be released on Thursday, but it's 11.50 p.m. I still gotta fucking process this and shit and edit it and whatnot, but... Uh, but yeah. I hope you guys have an awesome weekend. I'll be releasing another vlog on Monday, and hopefully we'll have even more exciting news for you. But stick around. Again, sub to me if you enjoy these. Talk to you soon. Peace! One, it would accept me.